This is a demonstration of a pecto-intercostal fascial block performed for refractory pain following sternotomy which limited respiratory function. For this procedure, the patient is placed in the supine or sitting position with the anesthesiologist located at the head of the patient. The patient is then prepped and draped in a sterile fashion. A linear ultrasound transducer is placed in a parasagittal orientation 2 to 3 centimeters lateral to the lateral border of the sternum. From superficial to deep, the structures are identified as the subcutaneous tissue, pectoralis major muscle, intercostal muscles, and the pleura. The intercostal muscles consist of the external, internal, and innermost intercostal muscle. The third and fourth ribs are also identified. An initial subcutaneous injection of lidocaine is performed. An echogenic needle is then advanced in plane in a cranial to caudal orientation under ultrasound guidance until the tip is identified between the pectoralis major and external intercostal muscle. A one to two milliliter bolus of saline is then injected to confirm interfascial spread. After confirmation, 10 to 15 milliliters of local anesthetic is injected. In this patient, 15 milliliters of 0.5% bupivacaine was injected and the procedure was repeated on the contralateral side.